Despite the chilly weather, crowds of people turned out to see Her Majesty the Queen arrive at Chichester Festival Theatre on Thursday morning. During a visit to West Sussex, the theatre became a stop on Her Majesty's tour for her to watch a very special performance by the Youth Theatre, which is the largest in the country. It's really, really thrilling. Obviously, we're, we're so touched that she's decided to come here. I'm absolutely thrilled. It's going to be an extraordinary day. Lots of fun. I think it's extraordinary that she chose to come here. I mean, obviously, it went to Canine as well, which would be lovely. But I, we're really, really honoured. It's a, it's a huge honour for us. She's been here twice before, um, and members of her family have been here. The Queen Mother's been here. Princess Alexandra and Princess Margaret have all been here. So it's really thrilling that, that the Queen has come here. And how excited are the children then? They are beside themselves. And they I are, think. they really are. It's <laughs> lovely. Absolutely. They're so, so excited. So excited. Everyone just feels very honoured. What do you hope then that the day will kind of bring? By the end of the day, what's kind of the feeling you want to have? Lots of pride, you know, yeah. in Chichester, in the Festival Theatre and in the work that we do here, particularly with the work with our community, because that's so important and at the core of everything we um, do. And what is really lovely is we see so many people already queuing to see the Queen so it's it's really makes us feel part of Chichester generally. Her Majesty arrived in a Range Rover surrounded by police escorts at around 20 past 12 before greeting various guests and then being whisked inside to watch the performance. For the crowds left outside though the cold became a distant memory after welcoming such a special visitor to their city. It was over in a flash to be honest, but it was amazing to see her because she's a very important person. Quite amazing. She's a queen. We've never seen her before. Not even on telly. It was really good. She had her window down, so we had a really good view. From there. And then I went, actually went back there and I could see through the glass really clearly. So I was surprised at the amount of people that could come today as it's Thank cold. It's a lovely day, it's dry and it's, yeah, really nice, sunny. I think it's really important for the youth theatre um, because um, um, my children used to be at the youth theatre. It's a huge part of the theatre. And Daniel Evans, who's taken over the theatre, just the theatre, um, how wonderful for all these young children, you know, to be performing in front of the Queen today, and that's just amazing. And it's lovely to see her going in and looking so gorgeous in her pink outfit. Why have you come here today? To see the Queen! And you're dressed in a very well, lovely outfit. So thank you very much. That. I um, planned it two weeks ago now. It's been up ready. Um, oh, for, went for the red and white and the blue theme. And uh, got especially got the iron out last night just for, just for the Queen. <laughs> Bless her. And what was it like seeing her then here today? It was absolutely amazing. I'll never forget it. Uh, she's actually looked absolutely beautiful. She looks stunning. She always does. Today is just, uh, absolutely, just amazing. I'll never, ever, ever forget it. Biggest Royal fan ever. Really, really do appreciate all that they do for us. One member of the crowd saw the Queen on her last visit in the theatre's inaugural season 50 years ago. I was working here in the theatre. So I was behind scenes, so to speak, but met them all, even the Queen Mother when she came in 1964. So what was it like then seeing her here again, 50 years down the line? Well, she's always the same. She's just a little more hunched. For the showcase, the youth theatre performed a scene from their Christmas show, which will be Beauty and the Beast, and also sang some songs from Fiddler on the Roof, performed in the summer and seen by over 80,000 people. Afterwards, with the young performers on Cloud Nine, Her Majesty was taken to have lunch with special guests. I mean, it was amazing. No, like, no one can say like that they perform for the Queen, and the fact that we can, being part of the youth theatre, is just incredible. And how long have you been rehearsing for this performance, then? Um, I mean, we didn't really know what it was for quite a while, like because obviously they had to keep it proper secret. Um, but I guess we kind of pieced it all together and had about three, three. proper runs of it. Um, so yeah, it was kind of flung together at the last minute, but yeah, it was really fun. Hopefully people took lots of pictures. Yeah. <laughs> That's the only horrible thing about actually being in it, is that you need to trust everyone else to take pictures and stuff for you so that we can have that to remember it. And I mean, we'll never forget no, it. No, it's definitely but... something that will stick with you. For yeah, everyone. exactly. So. Raya Barton, That's TV.